Hi, in this video we're going to show you how to add a permanently delete context uh, item to your right click menu so that way you can just right click on something and choose permanently delete because if you were to just use the regular delete right here and so it'll actually say delete if you're in Windows 10 uh, it'll just send it to the recycle bin and it's not going to be gone so you'll still be using that space and you probably know you could click on an item uh, hold down shift and then delete and then you could permanently delete it as well so this way it's going to save you just a step here by only having to use one hand. So if you have your other hand full or something, you could just still right click, click on a file or folder and permanently delete it. So to do that, we're going to do a quick registry edit. So to run that, you got to go to your start, do a search for regedit. So this is kind of a lengthy uh, edit here. So I'm going to show you the steps just to show you how it's done. And then at the end, I'm, I'm going to have a... Uh, registry file that you could just double click and import and I'll put that in the description but if you want to see how or what's actually happening then you could follow along here so the first thing you want to do is navigate to this key so you just copy and paste this from the description okay then we have shell so in that shell we want to make a new key called Windows Permanent Delete so you can either right click here or right click here new key paste it in and then we need a new string called command state sync so right click in a blank spot or you could right click on that make sure you pick string not d word value or key okay okay then we need another new string called explorer command command helper or handler i should say okay now we want to double click this explorer command handler and enter this for the value with the brackets double click it paste that in the value okay you can see the values there then we need another new string called icon so a bunch of strings here and then for that string we want to double click that and put in this value this is to have the icon for the right click menu item the little red X okay then finally we need a new string called top And then within that, we want to double click that and add top for the value. That's going to put the um, uh, permanently delete option at the top of the menu, or you can put bottom if you want it on the bottom of the menu. We're going to do top. Okay, so that's that. All right, so here's what we have after adding all of our strings here and our values to the strings. So now you shouldn't have to reboot or restart Windows Explorer. So if we right click on this, go to show more options, see we have permanently delete. And if you're in Windows 10, obviously you don't have to click on show more options, you just have everything in one spot. And we do have a video on how to uh, make the right click menu for Windows 11 work like Windows 10 where you don't have to do this show more options nonsense. But anyway, so now we have that. It's still going to give you this uh, prompt here saying asking if you want to permanently delete it. We just say yes to that. So just a quick way to have to do that without having to hold down shift or empty the recycle bin afterwards. So I have this uh, all in a reg file here, which I'll put in the description. And to add it, you just double click it, run, and say yes, do you want to add it to the registry? I already have it in there, so I'm going to say no. And that'll do all these steps for you so you don't have to do it. Or you could do it manually so you kind of get an idea of what you're doing. And I'll put all the steps in there as well. All right, thanks for watching and be sure to subscribe. Thank <laughs> you.